Denver Broncos safety TJ Ward. He's coming back home to where it all started as a high school player right here in the Bay Area. ABC 7 sports anchor Mike Schumann joining us live now from the South Bay. He's at Levi's Stadium and telling the story of TJ Ward through the eyes of his parents. Shu? All right, Larry. Well, any athlete who makes it to the top of their sport at the professional level had great family support, and T.J. Ward falls into that category. Right here. Right. Now, didn't he change positions? Lanita and Terrell Ward were high school sweethearts in San Francisco and raised three kids here in the Bay Area. They wanted their son T.J. to get a good education, so they sent him to De La Salle High School in Concord. Him being my firstborn and not having an older brother, I wanted him to get the brotherhood experience from De La Salle. That brotherhood we had there, and, I, and it's funny because I feel that same way about this team. His dad, Terrell Sr., coached his son at De La Salle after his three-year career in the NFL with the Eagles. Terrell Sr. played in Super Bowl 15. Now his son, TJ, is in Super Bowl 50. It's amazing. It's like it's just like a full circle to have your son um, reach this opportunity you know, which is tremendous. We all know most boys get their athletic ability from their mother. Right. <laughs> Dad worked with both his boys, TJ and Teron, who's a rookie with the Falcons, teaching them to play the game the right way. At some point they go, Dad, I got it. I've heard it a thousand times. And I go, okay. While their mother carpooled them everywhere in three different sports. My parents were everything to getting here. Um, if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be here. My work ethic, you know, uh, determination, intelligence. TJ spent his first four years with the Cleveland Browns, and this offseason he told his parents he was training for this year's Super Bowl in San Francisco. For him to achieve that dream? Words cannot describe how excited I am for him. I mean, when your child accomplishes his goal and then do it at the highest peak that is possible, it's just indescribable. The entire family will be at Sunday's game, and as always, they hope TJ comes away healthy, and with a victory. This road for TJ hasn't been easy, but my husband would always say, it's not where you start it, it's where you finish. And look where he's finishing, at the Super Bowl. One of the best NFL family stories I've ever been associated with. So when we got through, I started talking to his dad. I said, where'd you go to school? And Terrell said, San Diego State. I said, how old are you? A year younger than I. We turned out we played against each other back in 1975, Florida State and San Diego State. I remember the game. I said to him, I caught seven passes on you. He goes, you did. And he paused and he says, but we beat you. And that's all that counts in the end. What a small world. And I'll tell you what, just a great family, and we're all pulling for TJ in the Super Bowl. Reporting in uh, Santa Clara, Mike Schumann. Let's throw it back to you, Larry.